Hey, what's happening? Good morning, everyone. This is Frankie B. Washington, commercial illustrator. Been doing it for over 30 years now and, and enjoying it, man. You know, making sure to keep that art flowing. So anyway, as a life of a freelance artist, um, you know, I was working on a project, but then all of a sudden I got contacted um, to do a quick uh, sketch card um, from a company called Knuckle Supper Studios. I guess they have a uh, uh, crowdfunding project coming up and they, you know, asked me if I would, um, if they could commission me to do a sketch card. So I said, sure, all right. So I threw it up on the pile. You know, that's the life of a freelancer, man. You know, you don't, you really want to be saying no. You want to be able to um, work, hopefully, and, and have enough time to be able to do stuff. Don't kill yourself. You know, I've reached that fine age where I kind of know how to, um, I'm very mindful and you know mindful of, of how i deal with my projects and stuff like that making sure to take care of my own health and wellness as well all right so anyway um i'm using again a lot of my old I, you know i'm almost but i i hate just getting rid of stuff so this is pretty much one of my old cars i did i did this black line over here um in sharpie because originally it has a, it has my old website which which is non-functioning um, so I just put a line in there so it looks like the art anyway, it works and stuff. It's a pretty picture of me as a kid drawing. Um, and I just signed it in the back. And then what I'm gonna do is, you know, sketch up in here, do just for drawing. Now I'm gonna try to keep this really short because again, the rest of the video is gonna be a hyperlapse. I'm really enjoying these mashup videos and I think a lot of other people are enjoying them as well because it allows you to, um, you know, I can get kind of long-winded, man. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to hear a bunch of talking. So, you know, it, it helps to, you know, start it off. And then you, know, you get to see the fast drawing and stuff like that. So anyway, the character is called Buckle. Book, no, excuse me. Is it Buckle? Buckle 9. It's like a robot kid. And um, the first thing that the client told me was that they immediately was like, Rusty the boy robot. And I've drawn Rusty before. So that kind of made me very happy with that one. So I'm just going to go ahead and begin to establish the... Uh, the the art so this is called gestural drawing this is me uh got a blue pencil right here i have a lot of old i have a lot of like i'm like a hoarder with art utensils so a lot of these things are like old pencils that i've had for like years and years i can't even tell you what the make is on this one but it but it is a non-photo blue and pretty much the character is um i'm just gonna do a standard uh sort of lifting something really heavy over um, his head kind of thing because in the in the uh, description it says that he has super strength it says uh but there are command from accounts of flight superhuman strength able to speak to other mechanical constructs i say kind of like that that he can fly too so maybe i'll put that in there too so this is a gesture drawing and again staying nice and loose remember that you know i see a lot of people and and they suffer like how i used to when i was back in my 20s and stuff even in high school was you know it took me going to to work for an animation studio to really open up that part of me where it was like okay you, you got to loosen up with your sketching you're, you're overthinking it too much and you, you kind of want to make sure that you get the the energy of what you're trying to do and then build off of that so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna show his leg up you know and again this is just you know just getting a sense of this character and stuff like that don't always try to search for something that's like oh, i'm trying to be so perfect I, I don't even think like that i just go man you know you know, I'm just trying to make something that, you know, I'm in the flow of it. I don't, I honestly don't think about that stuff. I don't overthink it. One of the things about my um, many times instructors that I've had, excuse me, instructor, instructors that I've had over the years was that they said, you know, Frank, you just kind of got to go with the flow. And that's, that's the whole point of the art flow is like not getting too uh, really crazy about something. So I asked him, I have it like he's, he's doing like his boot jets and stuff. So he's caught this mass of whatever. Now, um, for me doing sketch cards, I know there's a lot of people who kind of like headshots and stuff like that. I'm just not in that frame of mind. You know, I challenge myself in the sense that um, drawing something that's going to be, you know, um, you know, like almost like you're capturing like this full piece of art, but, you know, reduced down to two and a two by five by three by five. So that's just me. You know, everyone has their, their flavor. So there's no there's no there's no uh, throwing shade on anything coming all right so let's do this so again i'm just getting a shape so you can see right here now i'm gonna maybe draw a couple of buildings in the back because i want to give a sense of that possibly he's he's high up 
you know, so you, you draw a couple little structures in there. Yeah. And whatever is whatever he's saving right now, um, hmm. I'll, I'll I'll just figure out. I'm not gonna overthink it too much, you know. So there you go. This will be called a gestural drawing. I, I hope that more people, um, I, I would suggest to any uh, up and coming artist out there is to practice. Just just don't overthink it and just practice, practice, practice on gestural. You know, get get loose with your drawing. You know, just getting shapes and whatever. As you see, I'm doing a bunch of different shapes here. Not not focusing and worrying too much on stuff until you know I need to, I need to until. The, finally start building up on it which will be the drawing side of it so here let's get these boot jets going down it's amazing what you can get in these small little uh you know frames right here so anyway here's a little close-up of that so that looks pretty good and then I'll, what i'll do is i'll leave a little area like a, i'll throw a little sign my name in there room enough so i can sign it right here too so it's like a little picture frame right there too all right so cool there you go. All right, so there you go. There's the start. So there's the start of the the artwork. And now what I'm going to do is we're going to switch over to the hyperlapse, which will be me penciling it and then inking it. And then, phew, I may even go far as maybe drawing the gray tones on it as well. Hey, you know, hey, complete it up. So anyway, um, all right. Thank you for watching this video and um, keep watching. Peace.